Hello and welcome back to the Excel Tip videos. Today in this video, we will show you how to remove extra spaces, line breaks and known breaking spaces using trim function along with other text functions in Excel. Trim function is very useful for cleaning up the text extracted or fetched from another application that may have come with extra or irregular spaces. In other words, trim is used to remove all spaces except single space between the words or characters. The function only removes the additional spaces represented by ASCII numeric code 32 from text. However, it does not remove known breaking or known printable space characters which are commonly used in web pages as a HTML entity. Let's see how trim function works in Excel with the help of examples. As we can see, we have taken three different sample data in column A and F and in column B and G we will use trim function to remove unnecessary spaces from the text. So we start with the first example and we enter trim function in cell B9 and hit tab 2 to complete. As you can see, trim function takes only single argument which is text. It is a text or string from which you want to remove the extra spaces. And as we want to remove the extra space for column A, so we take A9 in the argument and hit enter. The moment we hit enter, we can see that the function has removed all the extra spaces in the string except single space between the words and has returned in cell B9. And the function takes the same action when there are leading and trailing spaces in the string and returns with single space between the words. Now when we drag the formula to the end. The function removes all extra leading and trailing spaces and returns in corresponding cells. Now let's see what happens when there is a text with extra spaces and line breaks. As we can see cell F9 and F10 have few extra spaces and when we select and click on wrap text we can see the line breaks too. Alright we again click on wrap text. Now we go to cell G9 and enter trim function and select F9 and hit enter. Now we copy and paste the function in G10 or you can drag it as well. All right. Trim has removed the extra spaces but not completely and when we wrap text both the cells we can still see the line breaks. That is because trim function only removes the additional spaces while non printable characters cannot be removed with trim. Non printable characters can only be removed by clean function so we get into the edit mode and we nest clean function inside trim function and we will continue with f9 as the argument and then we close the parenthesis to end the trim function and hit enter. The moment we hit enter clean function removes the line break in the cell and at the same time trim removes the extra and unwanted spaces and both functions return the string in single line only with single space between the words. So we drag the formula to the next cell and here you go. We have not only removed the extra spaces but also removed the line breaks in the string and cleaned the data. So we again click on wrap text and make it normal. Now we move on to the last example where we will see what happens when there is a hard space or non breaking spaces are used in the data. So we enter trim function in cell G14 and we take F14 where the string contains Excel tape with few extra spaces between the characters and hit enter. As soon as we hit enter we see nothing happens and function returns with the actual string that contains few extra spaces between the words and same is the case with the other cell also uh, it returns an actual value only but why that is because the spaces which we can see there are not additional spaces they are known breaking uh, which is also known as hard space and they cannot be removed with the trim function but how to recognize them and how to remove them to the untrained eyes they look exactly the same and that is why it is very difficult to recognize them whether it is a blank character or blank space. But as we know on a computer each character has a number known as its ASCII code or value which creates one set of 255 characters and symbol for using computer program. 
the ACI code for a regular space is 32 whereas for non-breaking space it is 160 and you can recognize them using code function which will give you the ACI code of that particular character. To check we go to cell F17 and we hit single space and then enter. Then we go to cell F14 and we copy one single space from it and paste it in F18 and then we go to cell G17 and we enter code function which gives the numeric code for the first character in a text string. Okay, we take F17 and hit enter. As soon as we hit enter, we get 32, which means there is a regular space in cell F17, which we manually entered. And when we copy the code function and paste it in G18, we get 160 as the code, which is a code of known breaking space that is known as hard spaces as well. And when we look at both the cells, they seem empty, but as the code function in cell G17 and G18 respectively shows, the cell F17 contains regular space while F18 contains non-breaking space which is also used in cell F14 and F15. You can simply use the substitute function to remove the non-breaking space nested inside trim function. So we go back to cell G14 and get into the edit mode. We enter substitute function nested inside the trim function and then hit tab to autocomplete. We will let F14 be our first argument as original string and then we use char function to replace hard space. So we type ACI code of non-breaking space and then we close the parenthesis and then we take single space inside quotation mark to replace blank character with it and hit enter. The moment we hit enter, function remove the hard spaces and return with only single space between the words and same goes for F15 string too. Well, this is how you can remove extra spaces, hard spaces and line breaks using trim function along with other text functions. If you like this video, don't forget to click on subscribe button to get regular updates and feel free to share this video tutorial with your friends as well. That's all for now. We hope you found this lesson informative. We shall meet again in our next lesson. Till then, happy learning and have a nice day. Thank you.